Yeah, and the text space is here, okay? Ah, okay. So, uh, thank you for the organizers. So, uh, I want to speak my uh, talk. Uh, the title is on co cycle co construction of a hot pipe violation and the hillable surfaces. Uh, this talk is pure mathematics and geometrical objects, so uh, perhaps. Uh, 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 all, uh, all people cannot understand this fact, so, but uh, uh, please uh, enjoy my talk. <laughs> so first, uh, we define, uh, uh, we explain uh, hope vibration. Uh, so, okay. Uh, uh, this is a famous uh, uh, mathematical object. The hope vibration is a. Uh, 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 Three-dimensional sphere is a S1 bundle over CP1. CP1 is a complex project of space, a two-dimensional sphere. Okay, uh, it looks like a, 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 a cylinder. So S1 is a cylinder. Is a S1 is base manifold and fiber is a real, real line. However, if uh, we uh, want to uh, change the uh, global objects, so uh, change the uh, fibers, fibers is uh, 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 growing, uh, here is the same, but another is changes. It is possible to construct a uh, maybe spot. It is a general uh, consideration, general idea of the vibrations. So, next, uh, this is a uh, famous uh, hope vibration, but uh, 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 usual people cannot understand, so it's not right. can be considered as a generalization of the cylinder. So it is possible. Uh, sorry, are you doing? Where? So next is a more more difficult object is Hilsberg surface. Hilsberg uh, is a. Uh, 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 Geometer of uh, uh, German, he, he's very famous so in mathematical, uh, mathematics. So uh, Hilbert surface is defined by uh, these uh, equations is in CP1 cross CP2 is a complex project, one dimensional complex project space and two dimensional complex project spaces and defined by these equations. The, this uh, uh, complex surface is also can be considered as a total space of a non trivial fiber bundle over CP1, or with fiber is also the same CP1. Uh, like the uh, same as uh, S1 is a real line and CP1 is the CP1. So uh, from this construction, it can be considered as uh, these uh, vibrations. Uh, it just uh, looks like this one. Uh, I want to explain this relationship with these fiber bundles and uh, these fiber bundles. We explain this. And uh, our main, uh, main uh, purposes is uh, lens, three dimensional lens spaces can be realized as a real hypersurface in uh, Hilsberg surfaces of WM. Uh, we explain these uh, explicit relations, relationships and uh, of these uh, manifolds. Next, so uh, we explain uh, first uh, co cycle uh, construction uh, of fiber bundle. Co cycle data of fiber bundle is a uh, very uh, elementary object, but uh, it is difficult to understand. So uh, let uh, we, const, uh, we set a uh, uh, CMPT manifold M. Uh, it's an open covering of U alpha. And G is a finite dimensional ray groups. And pi is a, a principal G bundle over M. Uh, can, this, this object can be considered as a, a, a cylinder. So uh, P is a cylinder and M is a S1. And uh, uh, we construct a collection of transition functions. Uh, G beta alpha is a Intersection of the you are uh, open cover, open covering, and intersections there. So we define uh, functions requires the following condition. This is a famous cycle data. So, so uh, 
this is very natural conditions, but uh, the meaning is very uh, naive construction. So this is very uh, uh, complicated. So, but uh, this collection uh, functions is good for a constant fiber bundle. So cosmical condition uh, construction is a uh, following. Uh, uh, given base manifold M, and we construct uh, uh, total space of uh, X. Here is a, X is a total space. Uh, uh, the construction is very simple. Uh, take a, a product manifold, and the gluing condition is here. So it is possible to uh, equivalence relation. But equivalence relation is very difficult to understand to, Japan, uh, to mathematics. So this, this equivalence relation is to understand is uh, perhaps not easy to understand. So the, so the uh, quotient space uh, or uh, residue class space, class group spaces, so this, this object is very complicated. But this is a very simple. So we construct this uh, manifold. Uh, uh, so uh, more elementary, we uh, say uh, we uh, 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 construct the uh, uh, hope fiber relation more uh, concretely. So uh, base manifold is uh, comp <coughs> one dimension complex project spaces, which is diffeomorphic to S2. And uh, the take a uh, uh, rig of G, which is a uh, S1. And, <laughs> and pi is a hope vibration is defined by is as follows. Uh, sorry. Uh, sorry. Cocycle so. data is defined by is in this way. So this is a S1, S1 valued functions. So, oh, and this, this condition uh, define uh, uh, S3. That, uh, the quotient space is uh, dependent up to S3. We can show that it is, po it is possible, but not so easy to understand this fact. And uh, more, more, co more uh, complicated object I want to construct, the co-cycle data, G alpha beta, and M, uh, uh, M uh, Okay, uh, 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 multiple many times. So, and uh, uh, no, pair M is a non-negative non integer, so the quotient space is X over M is a principal S1 bundle over SCP1, but uh, this is different from the S3. Uh, it's a uh, uh, lens space is S3 over ZEM. Uh, uh, this one, this one. Okay. And uh, next, uh, our object to hope vibration and, uh, and its relationships pro, uh, from uh, uh, hope vibration and Hillsborough surfaces. Uh, I want to explain this uh, relationship. The quotient manifold is, uh, this can be considered as a, a Hillsborough surface, is a, a, a <coughs> complex sum manifold of CP1 cross CP2. Uh, and which is defined by, uh, I uh, explained uh, already, so X, uh, M, uh, M multiple, so this one is uh, huge number of surfaces, uh, very famous uh, complex surface. Uh, complex surface is a uh, uh, very uh, uh, delicate uh, definition, so uh, mm, uh, uh, CP1 cross CP2 has a complex structure. So, uh, four dimension WM is a four dimension sub manifold, real sub manifold, and uh, whose complex structure from uh, CP1 cross to CP2. Then uh, it's a, a complex sub manifold. So, it, it's in, in, this old, in this complex structure, uh, the complex structure is very uh, difficult notions of. Uh, 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 Difficult object, so uh, in in uh, not geometry, so so very difficult. But uh, it is WM is a very nice structure, a complex sub manifold, CP1 cross CP2. So and uh, 
more, more nice structure is a CP1 bundle, and CP1 bundle over fiber is also CP1. This is a very delicate uh, object. So, and uh, this fact is well known. Uh, is a uh, even W is a different CP1 cross CP1. And the old version is a, a one point blowing up to CP2. It is possible. <laughs> so very, 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 very good examples. And uh, this is known that uh, his surface is, uh, uh, in this complex structure is different from uh, each M. So. So, and uh, uh, next uh, we s explain a co-cycle construction of lens spaces and histable surface is possible. And uh, we explain this, uh, let uh, U0 and U1 and open covering of CP1, uh, two, two open, uh, two, two subsets, so. And uh, for example, can be considered as a open hemisphere and an under hemisphere, so. And uh, join, a, join two submanifold, uh, cylinder join, but uh, the uh, gluing is very difficult. It is possible to, in this way, then uh, we, ah, sorry, then we obtain a global, global uh, object of realization of this manifold. Then uh, we obtain a, a nice map to, uh, uh, Lens spaces to uh, Hilbert surface. So, and uh, uh, the quotient manifold can be uh, realized in this way. And this is a realization uh, theorem uh, to lens spaces to Hilbert surfaces is possible. Next, uh, uh, we explain special cases uh, and uh, Hilbert surfaces for uh, W one m equal is uh, set m equal one. In this case, the uh, uh, image of uh, this is a diffeomorphic to S three. Uh, the image is defined by this way. In this way, this is a uh, 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 oh, sorry. This is a correspond uh, uh, three-dimensional very Berger space. Berger is very famous geometer uh, in Frank, French. So, and uh, this this is uh, some uh, uh, some re representation of the Berger sphere. And we obtain uh, this uh, uh, geometrical uh, pro uh, geometrical uh, sorry. We have this uh, uh, some manifolds to construct these maps. So uh, this is a Hilbert surface. Is a, this is a Berger sphere? Is a diffeomorphic to the, uh, no no uh, uh, main object? Ah uh, sorry, main main uh, object of Berger sphere. So and this is a complex submanifold of W one is a Hilbert surface. Is and um, to construct uh, th this CP1 cross CP2 can be considered as a fiber bundle over S3 cross S5, and each fiber is a T2. It is, uh, this is a Kalbeckman manifold. Kalbeckman is also very famous, uh, geometer, so and uh, this this sub manifold can be realized this way. And this is very interesting object. It is possible to one to uh, to M. It is possible uh, generalization, but uh, we we, con we uh, concentrate my uh, uh, concentrate this talk uh, here. So and uh, in particular, the, this uh, bar, uh, bar pi inverse W one is very interesting object to uh, study a complex structure. So we explain this uh, uh, complex structures. Yeah, this this uh, omega inverse W one is defined by in this way. This is a different comp uh, uh, S three cross S three is a CP one CP one cross CP one base manifold CP one 
cross CP1, and phi by T2 is possible to define a complex structure that is a Kalbeckman manifold. But uh, this construction is different from the Kalbeckman manifold. I, I will explain this. So, uh, this is, this, this, yeah, yeah. Uh, Uh, the, the auto dimensional uh, total space, uh, the product of auto dimension two spheres, so total space. And uh, th this, uh, uh, sorry, this is a, 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 a complex structure of uh, this one is a Kalbeck manifold. But uh, uh, so, uh, uh, but uh, this, this pi mass w one is different from uh, this complex structure, a strict S3. S3. Uh, it, but uh, uh, we want to explain more uh, explicitly the CPM cross CPM is a complex manifold, complex manifold so admit to a complex structure. And it's far by T2, so uh, it is, uh, S1 action is possible to construct a Pi was uh, complex structure. To join a uh, complex structure is Kalbeck manifold. And uh, however, uh, our construction to uh, pi inverse W1 is different from this. So, and uh, this this is fact is, is can be shown. So, this is different from complex structures. So. The, uh, uh, the, the reason is uh, uh, the action is different from, this action is different from Kalbeckman uh, uh, manifold. So it is obtained this fact. And ne next, uh, I, uh, this fact is a uh, 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 construction of complex structures of uh, related to uh, uh, Hilsberg surface of W1. So next, uh, we want to uh, restrict ourselves to basic sphere. So uh, next, uh, we construct isometric embedding uh, of basic three sphere. Yeah, we define uh, these maps. Uh, this is a uh, uh, first part. Is uh, looks like a weighted uh, hop fibrations, and defined it in this way. Then uh, the inverse image of the uh, Berger sphere is defined by in this way. And Berger sphere is, from this, we can define uh, uh, Berger sphere two, uh, two dimensional sphere and three dimensional sphere, some, some radius. So Berger sphere can be uh, realized asymmetric embeddings in this way. So more concretely, uh, in this way. So this is, uh, uh, sorry, sorry. Uh, uh, and this is possible to construct these maps is isometric embeddings. From, uh, this is, uh, uh, the, the induced metric is from CP2 is possible to construct these maps is isometric embeddings. Very, very uh, complicated, so, but it is possible to, from this, from this. So, and um, conclusion is uh, uh, summarizing, sum, uh, summarizing up, uh, summing up this uh, 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 talk, uh, conclusions, uh, so I, I said, the well-known hope vibration can be realized as a sub-bundle of his surface of W1. <coughs> Uh, also, another fiber band for example, uh, lens spaces can be realized as a bundle of his surface of WM so for some M. M is a non negative entity. So, next is we can construct a complex structure different from Kalabi Ekman manifold on S3 cross S3, which is the inverse image of Hilsberg surfaces of W1. So, and uh, the hope, can, hope vibration can be considered as a hypersurface of a Hilsberg surface of a W1. This hypersurface naturally corresponds to some uh, Berger sphere in CP2. And we obtain an isometric equivalent realization map from uh, 
hypersize is to S2 cross S3. So, uh, next we explain further researches. First, uh, investigate the geometric structure of Papa inverse MR. What is uh, this, this uh, geometric structure or admit or not? So, for example, contact structure or CR structure on uh, Papa inverse MR. This is a, a three dimensional, uh, uh, five dimensional manifold. So, and uh, realize the uh, inverse basic, Omega inverse WM over Hilsberg surfaces. Uh, this, uh, on this um, five dimensional manifold can admit a complex structure. So, please uh, uh, realize this uh, complex structure. So. And the Hilsberg surface is considered as a, uh, complex numbers. So it is possible to, complex number can be realized as uh, quaternions. Quaternion is a non, uh, no, uh, <laughs> sorry, sorry, sorry. Uh, non commutative associative algebra. So this is difficult, but it is possible. And uh, it, it, uh, on, uh, and uh, hope vibration can be uh, uh, extend seven dimensional exotic sphere, which is a very famous object to, to consider the John Milner. Uh, he he constructed this sphere, so it is possible to, can be considered as a summary hold of quaternion Hilbert surface. Is possible or not? Uh, this is a problem. So and. And more uh, normal division algebra is uh, uh, constant R, C, cot R is a real numbers, C is a complex numbers, H is a quaternions, and o, o is a octanions. Uh, octanion is a, a non commutative, non associative algebra, but uh, division algebra. Uh, but, uh, not a popular object, so. <laughs> so, but it is possible to construct these vibrations. Uh, so, so th this fact uh, 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 generalizes to uh, Hilbert surface from this uh, relation of Hilbert surfaces. I want to know. So, and more this this is the main object investigations of my uh, of my work. So. That's the exotic 14 dimensional G2. This is a very interesting object, but uh, not to understand <laughs> object. But uh, for, uh, this, uh, G2 is a generalization of SO3. So the very, very interesting object, four dimension, 14 dimensional exceptional regroups. So thank you for your attention.